there. This is Rom Wills coming back at you with yet another car video. Live action proof of the body game. Live action proof. And it's not a video I do. I don't be doing that stuff, uh, walking around in the streets with a camera and shit. Nah, this is, uh, in the description box, there'll be a couple videos to this, uh, channel, Goku Pump. And I was like, yeah, yeah, these dudes, this muscle, muscle men and stuff. And they walking around in uh, Miami. They did a couple videos of uh, women checking them out. And uh, they were asking the women two things. One, where the women would rate them on a scale of one to ten. And, and whether they would smash or pass. 95% of the women, 99% of the women said smash. Well, no, 95%. Some didn't answer because they were um, had entanglements. And then you had uh, uh, one, you know, they weren't down for anything, but they identified themselves as lesbians. Oh, my God. Yeah. Wait, wait a minute, y'all. All right. I just had to cough. Ah, this weather. Anyway, y'all, let me make sure this joint on here good. Yeah. So I wanted to share that though, man, because um, you know, I'm gonna tell you what. Y'all know my the base of my stuff is body game. That's really just the base of what I share publicly. Anybody who follow me on my other stuff, like on my Patreon, especially at my twenty dollar level, or if they. Dang, I should have got out the car. Uh, anyway, um, if they follow me at my $20 level on the Patreon or uh, got some of my on-demand stuff or, um, you know, follow me on my Connect Pile site, you know, I go deeper. The body game is just, that's, a, that's my freebie. That, that's just the base. But then you still got to learn how to uh, work that base. But even with that, I still get some people, they challenge it. See, understand something with me. You challenge anything I say, I'm the type, oh yeah, I will respond in a way of a sledgehammer to a fly. You know? I will respond. Because to me, if I say something, my word is bond. So, you know. Because, you know, I promote this philosophy one, well, mainly because it fucking worked for me. In fact, on my uh, membership side, I got a story for my guys on the membership side and stuff about the body game working for me now. But of those vi uh, videos I uh, shared and stuff, these, phew, shoot, these dudes at another level for me. You know, I mean, I could say, yeah, I could hit that when I was, what, in my, uh, late 20s and stuff, but uh, now I just have a good body bill. <laughs> and it works. Because even to this day it works for me. Women be saying, damn, a nice body. How old are you again? <laughs> uh, even with that age thing, people take me for my 40s. And they don't take me for my age. But that's cool. But yeah, the thing is, I said, let me share this because Look, you get some guys, they'll talk about everything. They, they act like the body don't matter to a woman. And I'm like, what? That's why I always do some videos talking about pointing it out. And you still get some people who be like, oh, it don't matter. Like the woman just stop at your neck and stuff. Don't look anyplace else. But you know what, though? Honestly, I think that's because you get a lot of men. They, don't, they act like women don't want to have sex. You know, act like women don't like having sex. Oh, no, they want it badly. When a woman cheat on a perfectly good husband that she ain't having sex with, she having sex with somebody. And if dudes, they, actually, I'm going to be real with you. If dudes understood that one simple thing about women, that they do want to have sex, just not with every single guy, but there are guys they'll have sex with happily. Understand that one simple thing and then all the guy had to do was say, okay, what those guys got that, in general, in general, what they have. And the only common denominator is the body. That's the only common denominator. Not the looks ain't the same. Some are handsome. Some are ugly, sexy. Economic background. 
Some can say they got money. Some, you know, they sleep on an air mattress somewhere. You got a few hobosexuals. They don't even have a place to sleep. But the common denominator has always been the body. Or at least, I'm going to tell you what. The woman always liked the body, even if she don't say it. I did a video on that last week. Even if the body don't look all muscular or could look whatever, you ask that woman, what do you like in a body? And she's going to describe just that. So it works no matter what. <laughs> it works. It's stuff. But I wanted to share, you know, those videos, watching those videos. And the thing was, what I found interesting in both the videos, it was a range of women. It was a range of women. It wasn't just like uh, one type of woman or something, or a certain type. It ranged as far as their body builds. Some were fine, some not so fine. You know, a general age range, all of that. And they all had the one thing in common. They were just, they were going crazy over these guys' bodies. And I'm just like, okay, let me show this to people. Especially some guys that don't want to believe it. And I'm going to tell you what, that really hit me. Because, you know, I don't really be promoting code approach or something. And I got a pimp mentality. Honestly, I got a pimp mentality to that whole approach thing. I got a pimp mentality. Pimps, pimps don't be chasing. They don't chase. Real pimps. So I got a pimp mentality. But for those who uh, really like code approach and stuff, you got to think. They were code approaching all these women asking them. They were walking up to them. They didn't just sit around. So, you know, so it got all this stuff. Because, you know, the thing with the body, well, I'm going to tell you what it is with the body. The body, and I said it, the women want to have sex. The body turns on a woman sexually. If you turn on sexually, you can be direct, indirect, cold approach, choosing signals, whatever. Once you turn them on sexually, all you have to do is recognize the signs. I get more into that on my Patreon on a deeper level, my $20 level. So, all you have to do is recognize the signs and shoot, after a while you get used to it. Because they always looking. All women always looking. And if you just have just the basics right there, shoot, all you, all you need then is be able to hold a coherent conversation. That's all you need at that point. Hold a coherent conversation. And you know what? Some people are gonna still they're gonna still try to find something. They'll find they they'll look at the like I said in one of those videos one time uh because most of these women were like nine, ten, somewhere like eleven, fifteen. There was one that said, Oh yeah, you're a two. And so I guarantee, I guarantee the detractors, people against body game, they'll look at that. Well, she said he was a two. You know, and they'll conveniently uh, gloss over that the woman also said she was a lesbian. I'm just saying, so you know, <laughs> they completely gloss over that. <laughs> you know, let me just say something about that. It's like you could get tons of proof, tons of visual proof. You could have studies, and somebody will still fight against it. And they really just fighting against it because well, they know they don't get that build, or they don't have the will and the discipline to build it. That's all it really is. That's all it really is. You don't have a will to do it. And it does take some will. Because uh, today was chest day for me. And I did my uh, usual 10 routines. My 10 routines. I always do four sets in each routine. So that I was putting up a lot of weight and everything. I was putting on a lot of weight. So what? That's 10 times 40, 400. Not bad for no guy. <laughs> but yeah, but I ain't gonna lie. I was like, I've been kind of blah lately. Need a vacation. I've been telling people I just need a vacation. So I wasn't, I wasn't feeling. So instead of just having that excuse or something, I just went in. I actually, uh, I actually upped everything. <laughs> I actually put five pounds more than I would usually do on everything. <laughs> Because that's how I just push it. But see, a lot of people don't got that will to do that. You know, they got the excuses and they want women to just want them. Just want them, no matter what they got going on. It don't work that way. Sex is a competition. 
That's why in uh, any given generation, only 40% of men actually put their genes into the future. And people, some guys want to get mad at the women for that, but, you know, the women's job is to put forward the best genes. Now, she, now she's supposed to think you got the best genes, but you scrawny looking or you're out of shape. Let's think about that. Let's think about that. They go into a trance. In fact, I got a video coming this week. I'm going to get more into uh, how that body game be making money. I should have went down that way. Yeah, I'm going to get into how that body game be making money. He ain't no joke. Yeah, I'm just listening for something. I got sharp hearing. If I hear just the slightest thing, I'm paying attention. But anyway... Anyway, right, check out those videos, see the proof, you know, and these dudes, they ain't shoot, even sub them, they ain't need my help to sub though, they, they got over 100,000 subs, I need their help to sub, <laughs> it's like, this the wolf, this the wolf pack right here, this is the channel for wolves, not for the masses, for the elite, but anyway though, let me stop where I gotta stop somewhere. I gotta stop somewhere. Let this truck pass. You know, when I was little, I get in the middle of a crowd, uh, busy oncoming traffic, get in the middle of the street and start tying my shit. That's a little crazy. And then while he cursing me out, I, after I finished tying one show, I started tying the other. <laughs> Oh Lord, I had some issues coming up. <laughs> so anyway, though, hey, the, oh, come on, come on, oh come on, the fuck, bitch. Yeah, I, I, yeah, that was coming. Damn. Anyway, y'all. Let me um let me pull back here, do my thing. Gotta go ahead and get something. So anyway, that's all I got for today, y'all. Get back with y'all later. Peace and blessings.